I've indicated that by yesterday we only had five suspects, today we have got six. It shows you that the number of people that are being arrested is increasing. Therefore, the investigations are continuing. We're not going to tell you the names because, as I'm saying, the court is happening in camera today. It's only when the matter is taken to an open uh, children's court where we'll know them, we can even able to see them, their faces. Are they males? Are all of them males? Are they men? Boys. Unfortunately, boys. I can't respond to that. Let us know it's that there are the six. Yes, but we don't have to go there. Allow the police and the justice to handle the matter until when the matter is in the public uh, court, where all of us we can be able to see them and release their names and faces at that point in time. So from here, are they? Where are they going? Yeah. From here, where are they going? We'll know that they will. They were in custody. We hope that the justice team, team will come up with the proper mechanism of making sure that they remain in custody even when they are children because there are rules and laws that allows children at that age to be in custody until when they appear according. Does custody mean when you papa is in jail? Are they in jail? That's what we want to know. Are they in jail? Because custody can mean a lot of things at this stage. Are they in jail? That's what we want to know. I want to remain to say they are in custody. Let's allow that. Police custody. Are they in jail? Police custody. Police custody. Police custody. Police custody. Police custody. If you have got information that you think can continue to help the police, please come forward and give that information to the police for us to make sure that we leave no stone unturned so that this matter must be rooted to the core.